George Russell in jab at Max Verstappen as Brit says F1 would be so exciting without him. George Russell has taken aim at Max Verstappen and Red Bull at the Belgian Grand Prix. George Russell has suggested Max Verstappen and Red Bull are making Formula One too boring at the Belgian Grand Prix. The Mercedes star insists F1 would be so exciting if Red Bull weren't competing such as the Milton Keynes-based squad's current advantage over the rest of the grid. The former Williams star made the remark while addressing crowds ahead of sprint qualifying at the Belgian Grand Prix. Russell said, Formula One would be so exciting if Max and Red Bull weren't here at the moment. The remark prompted a grin from Lewis Hamilton with the seven-time champion laughing at the jibe. The crowd also saw the funny side with many cheering at Russell's comment, despite the large Verstappen fan base that usually attends spa Francorchamps. Sky Sports host Karun Chandok would appear to agree with Russell's remarks as he made his own analysis on Friday night. The ex-F1 driver wrote on social media, Imagine how competitive F1 would look at the moment if the timesheets ignored Max. Eight-tenths to P2, while just six-tenths covers second to ninth. They guy is just operating on a whole other level at the moment. Mighty impressive to see. Hash Belgian GP. Sci C. Behind Red Bull, four teams have battled to be the runners-up at some stage this season. Aston Martin held the honor earlier on in the campaign, but have since dropped away as Mercedes and Ferrari have closed the gap. McLaren's resurgence has also been staggering with the British manufacturer securing a podium finish at the last two races. Meanwhile, the battle behind Red Bull is hotting up with Fernando Alonso and Hamilton separated by just six points in the Drivers' Championship. Aston Martin are just 39 points adrift of Mercedes compared to the Silver Arrow's 230-point deficit to Red Bull. Hamilton is sure to agree with his teammate after recently calling on FIA chiefs to halt Red Bull's dominance. He suggested teams should be stopped from developing their cars until a certain date after Christian Horner confirmed that some resources were now being piled into the RB20. Hamilton explained, They don't have to make any changes to this year's car anymore as they're so far ahead. He's cruising at 100 points ahead of us. I think the FIA should probably put a time when everyone is allowed to start developing on the next year's C.